Hey, what's up guys? This is my video on how to root and install a custom recovery on your Galaxy Note 2 GT N7100 running Android 4.4.2 KitKat. So recently we got the KitKat update. If you want to install it manually, check the link in the description. Rooting will void your warranty, but you will not lose any of your apps and data. But backing up your data is always safe. So without taking much of your time, let's begin. Now go ahead and hit link 2 from the description. That will give you Samsung keys. Download and install it on your PC. This is necessary for the drivers. Link 3 will take you to this page. Download PC Odin from here and extract the PC Odin zip file. You will be getting these files. Once done, hit link 4 from the description. That will take you to this page. Here click on get TWRP for your device and then type Galaxy Note 2. And here select the N7100 variant. Scroll down and make sure you go on to Odin method section. Click here and scroll down. And again here make sure you choose the TWRP recovery that says .img.tar. Download it. Once done, hit link 5 from the description that will give you the super user file. Download the zip file and transfer this super su file on your phone. Ok that's done. Now turn off your device. Once the device is off, hold the volume down, power and the home button at the same time until you see this. Now connect your phone to your PC via the USB cable. Press the volume up to continue and leave your phone connected. Now launch PC Odin, hit yes and here you must see this IDCOM tab blue. If you don't have this blue, that means your drivers are not installed correctly. Try uninstalling and reinstalling the Samsung keys, that will fix this issue. Once done, hit PDA and go to wherever you have the twrp.img recovery file. Select it and hit open. Now hit start. Ok. Once it says pass, you can just unplug your phone from your PC and wait for your phone to boot back. So guys we have successfully installed the custom recovery. Let's go ahead and update the super user file. So for that hit the volume up, power and the home button continuously until you see Galaxy Note 2 displayed on the screen. So we are now on the TWRP recovery. So guys this time I chose the TWRP recovery as I wanted the S5 UI on the Note 2 and the ROM that provides the S5 features requires TWRP recovery. So I will be coming up with that video, stay tuned for that. Ok now go to install and select the super SU file that you have copied earlier on your phone. Select it and swipe to confirm flash. Ok that's done, hit reboot system now. There you go guys, now we have the super user access as well. So thanks a lot for watching, I will be coming up with a video on how to get the Galaxy S5 features on the Note 2 like the ultra power saving mode, the toolbox, the Galaxy S5 UI, OK Google Now functionality etc. So stay tuned and you guys have a great time.